and greetings to all. In this video, I am going to explain the formation of Z bus matrix. Problem number one: Find the Z bus matrix for the power system network shown below. This network consists of four buses. One of the bus is considered as a reference bus. So, other than reference bus, we are having three buses: one, two, and three. Three buses corresponding to three cross three matrix. Z bus matrix is three cross three matrix here. The fourth bus is considered as a reference bus. What is the step number one? Add one ohm between new bus one to reference bus four. Have to redraw the diagram here. And what is the Z bus matrix? Here put one and one. And what is the impedance? Or what is the resistance here? That is one. Z bus consists of only one element. That is step number one. What is the step number two? In the step number two, add one ohm between new bus two to reference bus four. What is the element one ohm? Z bus order is increased by one. The Z bus consists of two cross two matrix. So put one two here, one two. Already we got the answer for Z one one. Now in this step we get the answer for Z two two. Put one. And what about Z one two? Is there any connection between two and one? Zero. Z two one also zero. This is the step number two. Next step number three. Add one ohm between new bus three to reference bus four. Here the order of the matrix is increased by one. We'll get three cross three matrix. Z bus one two three. Here put one two three. Already we got the answer for Z one one. Z two two. Now I have to fill the value Z three three. Z three three also one. Is there any connection between three one three two? No. One two one three. No. There is no connection between. The buses one and two, three and one, and three and two. So remaining all the elements simply put zero. This is the new matrix obtained from step number three. Then step number four. Add one ohm between old bus one and old bus two. This is the step number four. Here the order of the matrix increase by one. We get four cross four matrix here. But what is the actual Z bus matrix? It should be three cross three only. Therefore, the last column element and the last row element should be eliminated. How to find out the last column and row element? This matrix already obtained from the step number three. Here, one ohm is connected between one and two. These two buses. How to find out the fourth column element? Two minus one. Zero minus one is minus one. One minus zero is one. Zero minus zero is zero. Here also, two minus one minus one, one minus zero one, zero minus zero zero. This is Z four four element. How to find out this Z four four is small Z one two. Small Z one two is the element that is connected between bus one and two. Plus here the first one you have to take. And capital is at one one. 
second 2 you have to take plus z22 minus 2 into z12. Here 1 and 2 z12. Put the value 1 plus 1 z11 one one is 1. Then z22 two two is 1. 1 plus 1 plus 1 minus 0 that is equal to 3. Now I have to substitute the value 3. What is the next step? Have to eliminate the last column element and the last row element to find out the new matrix. So this column element and this row element should be eliminated. This is the step number 4. So this column element is eliminated, this row element eliminated. How to eliminate this? First of all, you have to write the 3 cross 3 matrix already obtained. 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1. Next, how to write minus 1 by z44. Then write these 3 elements, minus 1, 0, column elements you have to write. Then write the row element. Next, multiply this column element with the row element. So, what is the answer? That is obtained minus 1 into minus 1, that is 1, 1 into 1 by 3, that is 1 by 3. Minus 1 into 1, minus 1 by 3. Minus 1 into 0, 0. 1 into minus 1, minus 1 by 3. 1 into 1, 1 by 3. 1 into 0, 0. Then 0 is multiplied with all the elements, all are 0. Next, you have to subtract both. 1 minus 1 by 3, that is 2 by 3. 0 minus 1 by 3, plus 1 by 3. 0 minus 0 is 0. In the similar manner, finish the remaining row elements also. Now we get the 3 cross 3 matrix. Number 5. In the step number 5, add 1 ohm between old bus 1 and the old bus 3. Here also the matrix order is increased by 1. Already we are having 3 cross 3 matrix. Now we have 4 cross 4 matrix. But our Z bus should be 3 cross 3 only. What we have to do? The last column elements and the last row elements should be eliminated. Now I am going to explain how to find out the fourth row and fourth column elements. First you have to write the 3 cross 3 matrix and next 1 and 3. This is 1, this is third column. What I have to do? 0 minus 2 by 3. Minus 2 by 3. 0 minus 1 by 3. Minus 1 by 3. 1 minus 0. 1. In the row also how to write? 0 minus 2 by 3. Minus 2 by 3. 0 minus 1 by 3. Minus 1 by 3. 1 minus 0. 1. Next find out z44. How to find out this z44 is z13. What is z13? The element connected between bus 1 and bus 3. Next how to remember this one is there? No. So capital z11 you have to write. Plus 3 is there? No. Capital z33. And next 2 into z13. Not minus z13. 2 into z13. What is Z13? Z13 is the element connected between 1 and 3. That is 1. Z11 is what? 2 by 3. What is Z33? Also 1. Z13 is Z13 that is equal to 0. Substitute all the values. Finally, I get the answer 8 by 3. So how to find out the new Z bus? 2 by 3, 1 by 3, 0. 1 by 3, 2 by 3 and 0. 0, 0, 1 minus 
1 divided by z44. So, 8 by 3 and take this elements, column elements, minus 2 by 3, minus 1 by 3 and 1. And next, the row element, minus 2 by 3, minus 1 by 3 and 1. Next, have to multiply this, 3 by 8, no. Here, minus 2 by 3, into minus 2 by 3, 4 by 9. 2 by 9, then minus 2 by 3. Minus here, 2 by 9. 2 by, uh, minus 1 by 3, into minus 1 by 3, 1 by 9. Minus 1 by 3 into 1 minus 1 by 3. 1 into minus 2 by 3 minus 2 by 3. 1 into minus 1 by 3 minus 1 by 3. 1 into 1 that is 1. Minus 3 by 8. Have to multiply all the elements with 3 by 8. So 2 by 3 this matrix minus. I have to multiply this 4 by 9 with 3 by 8. I will get the answer 1 by 6. 2 by 9 into 3 by 8, 2, 4, that is 8 are cancelled, 4, 3, 3 is 9, so 1 by 12. Then minus 2 by 3 into 3 by 8, that is minus 1 by 4. In this way, you have to finish the remaining elements. After finishing this, you have to subtract one, first one and second. The answer is 2 by 3 minus 1 by 6. You have to take the LCM as 6. So 4 minus 1 by 6, 3 by 6, that is 1 by 2. 1 by 3 minus 1 by 12. That is, here multiply both with 4. So 4 minus 1, 3 by 12, that is 1 by 4. 0 minus half minus 1 by 4, that is plus 1 by 4. In this way, finish the remaining also. So, this is the final Z bus matrix. This is the 3 cross 3 matrix. Next, I am going to explain the problem number 2. Find the Z bus for the power system network shown below. This consists of 3 buses. The bus number 1 is considered as a reference bus. Remaining buses. 2, 1, 3. Corresponding to 2 buses, the Z bus is a 2 cross 2 matrix. What is the step number 1? Add 3 ohm between new bus 2 to reference bus. 1 is the reference bus. New bus 2 to reference bus. So, what is the Z bus? The Z bus equal to 3. Only one element, so Z bus equal to 3. And next step number 2. Add 3 ohm between new bus 3 to reference bus. New bus 3 to reference bus. Order of the matrix is increased by 1. The Z bus should have 2 cross 2 matrix. So Z bus you have to put 2 and 3. Here 2 and 3. Already we got the answer for Z22. Now we are going to find out Z33 that is also 3. Put the value. Is there any connection between 2 and 3? No. Put 0 here. Next step number 3. Add 3 ohm between old bus 2 to new bus 3. What about the order? The order of the matrix is increased by 1. This matrix consists of 3 cross 3. But the final Z bus matrix should have the order 2. What we are going, what we have to do? Have to eliminate the third row and third column elements. For eliminating this, what are the steps you are going to do? First of all, you have to write the 2 cross 2 matrix. How to find out the third element? The 3 ohm between or 2 old buses 2 and 3. So, 3 minus 2. 0 minus 3, that is minus 3. 3 minus 0 is 3. Here, minus 0 minus 3, minus 3. 3 minus 0, 3. Next, find out is 4, 4. 
first write small z23 what is small z23 indicates the impedance or resistance between 2 and 3 plus take this first 2 plus z22 and next take the second 3 z33 minus 2 into z23 this is a way to remember equal to 3 z23 is 3 what is z22 z22 also 3 z33 also 3 minus what is z23 z23 is 0 3 plus 3 plus 3 is equal to 9 how to find out z bus 2 cross 2 matrix you have to write it here minus 1 by z44 that is 9 take the column element minus 3 and 3 next write the row elements minus 3 and 3 3 0 0 3 minus 1 by 9 multiply these values minus plus 9 minus 9 minus 9 and plus 9 9 into 1 by 9 that is 1 minus 9 into 1 by 9 minus 1 minus 1 and 1 next 3 minus 1 is 2 0 minus of minus 1 is 1 0 minus of minus 1 is 1 3 minus 1 is 2 so this is the final Z bus matrix. Thank you. Have a nice day.